Welcome back to Crossout. This is my primary account, not the promo one. And I am currently essentially grinding my way up through the ranks. And we are now currently level 7 rep with the engineers. And I'm trying to get to 10 so I can join one of these guys. Uh, I think more than likely I might join scavengers. Uh, because I don't really care about this stuff. Um, when we can eventually do that and some of the like I don't really like the avia panels I like the heavier duty stuff and so I think I'll definitely join the scavengers and they actually have in the, the manufacturing area they have something I didn't even notice was in here the mammoth cannon which is insane looking hurricane launcher which is homing and then the Apollo generator which is for energy and so like this stuff you know all costs a lot of stuff but um, that's really cool. And so that's kind of what we're reaching for is uh, level 7 rep. And uh, I'm also trying to get more parts and stuff. I've changed my design since the last episode, which had like more MGs. And I might always go back to that, but I'm sporting the 76 now and just one one light up there. Um, and it this has been doing pretty well. It, it still gets wrecked pretty easily um, simply because of the armor situation but what i've noticed more than anything that the wheels come off a lot a lot easier so let's hop into battle and let's see if that helped at all because I, I i've just been having my wheels shot off way too much and it's getting really annoying because it basically immobilizes me and from what i realized too like the things in the front like the uh, the hatches they don't really like do much for me they're kind of a waste they don't really add that much damage um it's all it would almost be better Adding more. I wish I had some. Do I have any of those? That guy's build is sweet looking. Do I have any of those? I don't think I do. You know what? Let's do this, okay? Because these hatches are just these hatches are just pointless. They just do not do anything for me. I, I've been trying to ram somebody and kill them, and it just doesn't work. So let's just add on some more armor, and that's going to help us in the long run probably. And at least help our gun last longer because unless we get shot up from the side, I don't think that's gonna we're going to have any issues there. All right, here we go. Let's see if this uh, if these changes helped anything. If it made us, makes any difference, I think having those extra wheels is gonna help slightly. We'll find out, I guess, in the the long run. But I just, you know, it's I think it's gonna help me stay up longer in terms of like actually in the fight because I've been being immobilized and I just kind of I just kind of sit there. Okay, well wait, there's always somebody who comes dashing across the bridge. Yep, look. Oh, I missed the shot. Yeah, get immobilized. This guy's just pushing on. This guy's just rushing over here. They rushing the base or what? Trying to do that challenge? There's a challenge right now to uh, cap the enemy base. Dude, we got a huge hit. Oh my gosh, Adam. Oh no, oh no, oh no, big cannon. Oh, not anymore. Where's your cannon at, sucker? Oh, dude, get wrecked. Okay, so this thing is not nearly as maneuverable anymore as it once was. Dude, those guys just got annihilated. I have to cap the base, so I'm going to go try to try to do that. There's an I've never seen an AI sitting up there like that before. Keep going, keep going. Keep going, baby. You're good. Avoid the shots. There's so many of them. Oh no. It's dude, these wheels like made it was so like less maneuverable than it was before. <laughs> cap the base. We gotta cap this sucker. We got a long ways to go. And we gotta defend against a lot of people probably. Gector, two kills. Get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. Which way they're gonna come if they come? I got camo, baby. Camouflaged. I can last 30 seconds, man. Somebody shooting me for 30 seconds, I can totally last that long. That radar's annoying right there. We got this. 
I completed the challenge. Give me them creds. Or the rep or whatever. Is it rep or curse? <gasps> I got a shotgun. Go back to the garage. I've been waiting for a shotgun. Uh, oh, yeah. It's like... Is it scrap metal? It might be scrap metal. Okay. I got a shotgun. This is guys. Guys. This is what I've been waiting for. I got one shotgun. Three energy. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to trade this out. It's good and all, but it kind of uh, gets in the way sometimes. Um, okay. So, we need to re redesign this here. I hate these... Uh... Oh, it does. It actually did clip in. Okay. I was going to say, they sometimes don't clip in, and they're kind of annoying. Can manage that. And then let's put our shotgun... Right in the front, we have three. We have three points left. This is five. This is two. I guess we'll do another MG. Mo maximum maximum amount of parts. Uh, goodbye, radar. You were pointless anyways. You're not doing anything for us. Could do that. This is kind of bare right here. We could maybe we could have we could might we might actually be able to keep that there for shielding purposes. We'll test it out and see if it it might not have the depression now though. Also, I you gotta I don't know if I should have that there or not. Let's test it out. Okay, so it doesn't have the depression, but is it really needed right there in the front? Probably not. It's still not bad, but the shotgun's going to be so good at close range. It's so good. I wonder if I should put it somewhere else, though. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not sure if I should put it somewhere else. It's got pretty good protection right there, but it's like right in the front. And that can get blown off really easily. What if we put it back a ways? What if we just put it like right there? Let's see if that works. Can't shoot the shotgun because this doesn't have the elevation. Um, so let's see. What if we do... Do I have an additional part somewhere that I can spare to take off? Probably one of these. Actually, we can just take this from here and put this. Do I have another? Do I have any van, more van pieces? I don't. Uh, I was going to say we can r elevate that a little bit. Could do that. Yeah, could do that right there, and then let's well, let's shoot up over that. That's the real question. Probably not. Yeah, not nah. okay. So we do have to keep that down. It's okay. We're getting a shotgun build now. This is great because shotguns just tear people apart, man. They're so good, especially if you have multiple ones. Oh, oh, there we go. All right, let's. Let's take it out, man. Let's see what this thing can do. I'm excited. All right, here we go. Shotgun time. I could get rid of the hell pipes, but they're I think they're kind of essential in terms of uh they're they're essential in terms of like the rep gain. We're going to wait and see if anybody crosses over. Actually, since we got the shotgun build, we should probably try to get closer now. So, let's go down low. I love the look of this thing, though. I don't like how high it is, but I like the fact I'm using that other cabin, which helps a little bit. I don't think I can hit shotgun blast from... Oh! I got a kill. Well, somebody just came down. Somebody back here. Dig it there. Okay, let's not rush out there. The the What I noticed is the kill system. The kill... See, like that. I got the kill for that. It's, I mean, 
I guess it makes sense because it's not based on on uh, it's like based on the winning kill but I think it should be based on HP like how much HP you take away from them if you take the most away you should get the kill you know that's what I think at least dude you're running into the war zone right here Jamie these little buggies are so easy to destroy if you can actually hit them. Shotgun's got kind of limited ammo here. Obviously, I can't hit from the hit from the, the back because it's front facing. But come on, kill it! Holy crap! Time to move! Time to move! Time to move! Time to move! Crash Bandicoot back here, wrecking me with some big gun. I don't think so, man. It was a good choice having those wheels. I'm going to tell you that right now. Look at this. Still able to drive? I'm on fire, though. What the? Okay, maybe I'm not able to drive still. Somewhat. Somewhat. I'm actually somewhat able to. All right, Crash Bandicoot. Let's do this, man. Get that gun. Get that gun. Get the gun. Get. Th I'm going to move the shotgun to the top. Oh my gosh! What? I'm moving the shotgun to the top. Dude, that was some crap right there. That dude just freaking wrecked me. So let's do that and that. And then put this. Wait, no, we want it right on the top. And so let's put this here. This here. That's actually good because it's on two, two pieces. And so it shouldn't get blowing off as easily at least that's the hope all right we can roll with this now the question is do I do that and then that no so I can't no depression okay so that should be better because then the shotgun can hit all all around okay we'll move the hell pipes move the hell pipes the, the obstructing they're obstructing some of the shots. I'll put them right in the center for you crazy people who... Ah, it, it needs to be in the center. Ah, ah, ah. People who freak out over that. Okay, let's go back into battle and see what we can do. All right, here we go. Let's see what these changes have done for us. Hopefully it actually makes a difference having things where they are. The shotgun on the top. Now, I'm not too... I'm always getting confused by this map. I think people come like right over here right away. I mean, it's like immediate, it almost seems like. Yeah, people are coming. Dude, you made a mistake, man. Break that guy's side while he's got it exposed. Get him. I'm just going to sit here and snipe, man. I'm not going out there. Oh, we're doing a lot of damage with the MGs. Look at that. This guy's on fire. Nice, nice kills, Leo. I think Leo's got an auto cannon. Dang! That's what I'm talking about. We got a bogey back here. I'm getting chased on. Oh my gosh, this thing is like nowhere near as maneuverable as it was. Because I added those wheels on. Oh, did you lose a wheel? <laughs> got him. Got him. Trying to hit my guns on the top. It's kind of difficult. Two guys left. Holy crap. Oh, I don't like people who just sit there like that. Usually means he got a big gun. Or in this case, he's AFK. We got it. A bag. I got a bag. Ooh, I got another Avia booster. Scrap, scrap metal. I'm getting a lot of these Avia boosters. Uh, and I've been selling them for credits because I don't really plan on using those. Although I do want to make at least one build that is a melee build that rams people using those. So like you rock it into somebody. I think that that would be freaking sweet. But you got to put them on. You got to put boosters on the sides probably and one on the back to get it to work effectively. There's a lot of people coming into this match. Nice. Let's look at this guy. <laughs> look at this guy. The heck? What the heck, man? Okay, Leo's on the other team this time. I think he's got the auto cannon. 
I'm just gonna. I always sit here and just wait. People always come. Someone always comes. Look at the MGs on that thing. Hmm, maybe not. Maybe not this time. Oh, true shot. Look out, Nicholas. Stupid bot. We're going down low. Oh, there's three of them down here. Four of them. No, th just three of them. Here's Peter, the buggy. Get that. Get the buggy. Get it. We got him. He's dead. Lots of people coming. Lots of people coming. Dude, can you please watch where you're driving? Come on, man. One at a time here. You know, the shotgun hits from this far. It's got pretty widespread, though. Got him. All right, now we now let's be aggressive. Take out those guns. Take out the guns. Take out the guns. Come on. Kill assist that guy. Get the guns. Got him. And barely taking any damage. This is great. Our base is being capped. Really? Really? I've all my front stuff's got blown off, but I'm still like moving very well and got all my wheels still. Let's do this, dude. Where you going? Running? True shot. Those MGs, man. If you can, if you can, if you shoot off the, if you shoot off the the guns, I mean that's like they're done for. You shot. Oh no. Oh, I'm done. I was just saying. I was just saying it. Oh, I'm on fire. Oh no. Van doors protect me. That's what I get for talking trash, huh? That's what I get for talking trash. Get him, Nicholas. No, Leo. Leo, no. Oh no, Leo's on the other team. Never mind. <laughs> Anton. Anton got him. What's he got? Just an MG. He's. Oh, I think he probably had a lot of light machine guns. He's the only one left. True shot over here. The jerk that killed me. I don't think. Oh no. Oh no. The showdown. He's like, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. That's one way to get out. Get out of dodge. Good job, man. We lost. No. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So, uh, I think the shotgun build would definitely be a lot better if uh, we got more shotguns. You know, if we got more shotguns, lots of empty space here in the front. I mean, it's perfect for swapping out the 76 whenever I want to. Uh, I mean, that's kind of nice. You know, maybe we did, uh, let's see. We have, we have one point left, right? And these are two P's. What if we did this? What if we get 76 and a, uh, and a shotgun? It's kind of nice. We'll try that build out next. I hopefully I can grind a little bit before next episode. I might actually use the promo account for the next episode. I'm not too sure. We'll find out. I might like switch on and off and do some cool builds and then come back to grinding and stuff. And obviously I'm gonna try to grind and stuff like off screen too. So, you know, it's not just gonna be all uh you know, all on screen grinding or whatever. It's, I'm gonna I'll try my best to uh to do some stuff off screen and see what we can do. In terms of these these things protect me a little bit, not too much though, because you can shoot right through them. That's not that's a good. I didn't even realize that. That's probably what's happening is they're shooting right through those, and I'm getting killed as a result very easily. So let's let's uh, put those there, and then the tin caps. No, let's do a van door because we we have one more piece left actually. Uh, what can we put right here? Is there anything? A cap of some kind? What if we put... Nope, we can't put a cap there, so... Well, we can't put the tin cap... No, we can't put the tin caps. Uh, nope, that can be shot through. I'm assuming that this can probably be shot through, too. So, the best thing is the van side. And just to put it like that... And then we're out of space. What if we put uh, that that way and then wait? No, that's fine. We don't need to put another one in back there. It doesn't need that much protection in the back. It almost never gets 
hit up. But what we do need is probably some protection. Some more protection. Oh, that's nice, actually. That's good. That's going to help with the with the shotgun on top from getting shot off. Sweet. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thumbs up if you're new. Subscribe if you're new. Thumbs up if you like the video. Oh, gosh. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.